Hey y'all, happy new year and welcome back to my channel. Ellery here, first toot of 2019. And it's honestly, it's not that exciting, like what I'm about to do, but I obviously had to film something. I am still trying to continuously do one video a week, whether or not it's something you guys necessarily wanna see or not. I'm trying to be consistent at least. So it is a makeup tutorial, it's actually the New Year's look I actually did. I know I filmed a New Year's Eve uh, inspired tutorial that I was planning on wearing for my look. But I decided to go with some color and I really liked the eye look that I did for New Year's Eve and some of you guys liked it as well. And plus it's also using Karen's palette with ColourPop. So, you know, you will get to see me do a look with this because this is the palette I actually used for New Year's Eve. So I think you guys are still gonna like the tutorial. I know I told y'all I was retiring this black background back here that I was using at my old house. But uh, <laughs> it's the only backdrop I have and getting new backdrops are on my long list of things to do. I don't even really think y'all care. But for the people who do care and are tired of seeing it, it's on my long list. It's not the top, but it's on there. So um, listen. 2019 is gonna be the year. Ellery just, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna try to push out two videos a week, what? Yeah, that's my goal this year. It's not It's not starting just yet though. It's, it's gonna start a little further in the year, but it's a goal. So I just need y'all to work with me. Still transitioning, not fully moved in, but um, I appreciate y'all's patience with your girl. Okay, let's get started. So I didn't even take a picture of the look I did for New Year's Eve, the like a close up, cause I was like <sighs> sipping champagne at like eight o'clock in the morning, New Year's Eve. I wasn't thinking about no selfies. I did take some videos and that's where I was getting y'all's feedback saying, oh, that's fire. And I was like, thank you, I'll film it. <laughs> so um, I used one palette to create that cranberry with a touch of gold look. ColourPop collab with Karen. I don't know if her Instagram is I love Sarah too or I love Sarahi, but I just call it Karen because that's her name. Palette is fire. It looks very nice. I think, ooh, I just dug all in it. You know, I feel like color is all year long. So I'm a fan of all the different shades of colors, mattes, shimmers, metallics. It's very pretty and you can do a lot of different looks with it, including this one I'm about to do. Let's just hope that I can do it the same way. Ain't nothing worse than trying to, like doing a look super bomb and then trying to do it a second time and it'd be ugly. Like that is so annoying. It's like I'm the same person. I have the same hands. This ain't the same look. I think I'm gonna do the look on my left eye instead of my right eye. I usually always, you know, do this one first and then do the look for y'all on this eye, but I'ma switch it left like I'm empty decks, okay? Cause for some reason I got dry eye on this eye. My lid is like super flaky and I need to like exfoliate or something. So the first shade I use is called Euphoric. It is this matte shade right here. This is Morphe's M576 brush and I'm just gonna buff that as my first transition color. Just wanna kinda stamp it on first and then slowly blend it out. The next color I used was Misbehave. This matte shade down here. We kind of focus this one more so in the crease and blend these two colors together. Next, I used a small tapered blending brush and I went into Divina, Divina, Divina. This darker matte shade right here. And I just added a smidge of that in the outer V of the eye, just to kind of define that crease a little bit more. I'm doing this way slopplier, way slopplier than I did for New Year's Eve. But New Year's Eve, I had time. Today, I'm hungry. It was Yoshi's first day of school, which means I need some wine, because we was up way too early. It was just, I just, who cool child? Jesus be his annex. All right, for the lid, I'm using Lomo, this pretty coral shade right here. And I'm using a flat synthetic brush to pack that onto the lid area. And before I go in with my other lid color, I'm just gonna go and try to blend all those three colors I just used a little bit better to create more of a gradient look. And sometimes it helps to use different brushes or clean your brushes when you go back to clean up your transitions and blending just so you're not mudding up the lid with dirty brushes. 
All right, now I'm gonna grab this small detail brush. This is from BH Cosmetics. Very tiny, flat, synthetic brush. And I'm gonna spray it with some setting spray. Urban Decay All Nighter. Don't need that much since it's a small brush. And I'm gonna go into Mesmerize, this gold shade up here. And then I added that to the inner corner of my eye and also kind of used it as a liner a third way through my crease. Then I grabbed a smudger brush. This one is from Crown Brushes. It is their C462. And I went back into Misbehave and heavily lined my lower lash line. Why does it seem like there's like doo doo stain on my forehead? What is that? Is that makeup? It's kind of going away. Sheesh. All right, almost done. Just gotta line the waterline. This is Urban K's Perversion 24-7 Glide on Pencil. I use CoverGirl's 420 Matte Liner for my wing liner. I'm not sure which eyelashes I wore for New Year's, but I do like these Allure Lashes from House of Lashes. I actually wore them yesterday. So I'm just pop these babies on one more again. Now I just need some mascara for my bottom lashes. This is NARS Climax Mascara. And I'm also gonna blend in my real lashes with this as well. Well, she kinda looks like New Year's Eve. Maybe if I put the other one on and a wig, you know, I'll look more like I looked. All right, and finally for my lips that night, I kept it glossy. I did Stilo, my collab with ColourPop, and a brown liner. This is one I like to use. It's Chocolate by LA Girl, and it's not sharpened, so. I haven't unpacked. Y'all, can I tell you, this day has been so stressful. That's why my eyes is peeling and my face is peeling, because I've been crying all day that my salty tears had sucked up all the moisture off my face. Like. I've been so stressed out today. Like every little thing that could go wrong has gone wrong. Even like with the wig. I was supposed to have a wig on. Can't find my wig. Like it's nowhere to be found. Found out Zara's new pair of shoes, new pair, ain't even warm, were thrown away amongst other things. I know that sounds small, but just amongst other things. I've just had a really stressful day. So that was just my, my little vent right there. But you know, I don't have a sharpener. All my makeup is currently in this corner still in boxes, I haven't took it out yet. I just have, you know, essentials here. So I'm just gonna carefully use this liner. I don't need much anyway. I kind of just use it to define my lip shape. See, don't need much. And I'm just gonna add Stilo right on top of that. And here's the look. So I hope you guys enjoyed this eye look. It's actually one of my faves that I probably will keep in rotation. I have certain looks that I do every so often. This will probably be one of them. I really, really like it. Uh, if you like it too, let me know in the comments. Some um, uh, Hope you guys are having a great start to your 2019. And I will be filming again this week. So don't be coming for me in the comments. I have some reviews coming up. Don't you worry getting my shipping address changed as we speak so that I can finally start getting the rotation and giving you guys what you guys request and want to see. In the meantime, you can let me know your requests down below and I will make sure to um, add it to my to-do list. Cause I'm back y'all, I don't know if y'all know, but I'm back, okay? Shoot, I can't wait to start filming consistently again. I, I miss it. I miss looking cute every day and not going nowhere. <laughs> so make sure you guys are subscribed to see what's next on my channel. But until then, love you guys. Mwah.